Red a Ted Art. Look what I have for you today. Yes, it's paper puppet time here on Red Ted Art in time for Harvest Festival or just as a really, really cute forecraft. We have this little crow, uh, scarecrow puppet. So come on, let's take a look and see how it's made. So you will need your free um, printables uh, printed out onto some light, light cast stock, card a stock, I can't speak, some baker's twine, a needle, some brads, so this is what they look like, um, some scissors and of course some colouring pencils. Uh, and then you get to get going. So I'm going to start off with colouring in my... Um, scarecrow and you guys I'm going to speed this bit up in fact you know what I'm not going to speed this well I will speed this bit up I'm going to put another video up in the iCards for you to check out uh, and you can watch the coloring in of this uh, scarecrow separately or just keep watching here and we'll skip forward to making and assembling this adorable um, scarecrow craft so, okay so you've colored in your um, Scarecrow, now it's time to cut out all your pieces. Now again, as per usual, I'm going to fast forward, stroke skip, to, skip forward to where I've cut it all out and then we'll get to the actual assembly. So your scarecrow is all coloured out and uh, coloured in and cut out. Now you take a hole punch, look at the back to make sure you've got the position right and hole punch your pieces. Time to get your thread. Now I'm going to use some baker's twine. I love baker's twine. It comes in, you can get it in lots of different colours and I'm just going to snip a little bit off. I'm going to find my needle, <laughs> which is probably gone missing somewhere, and I'm going to thread it on. Okay, so first we're going to push the needle through this black hole, coming in from the back. And then through this hole here. Now I'm going to tie it off in a minute, I'm just going to leave a bit of space for knotting but you want to measure it all out against this in a minute. So let's just have that ready and we'll repeat the same for the legs. So here's the black hole. And again, leave a little bit of thread for knotting. And then we're going to use this again in a minute. So take your pieces, get your brads, push through, not too tight, so have it nice and loose, and the other side. Turn them around. Now this is the key thing, you want the arms and legs pointing down, so pointing down. You pull this across and this across and now you knot it so you have a nice straight line running across. And then you knot this down, so a nice straight line running across and snip. Now repeat down here. And now you need to secure this so you've got a nice eye shape. So 
So bring this into the middle. Put it in the middle. And again, not down here. So when it's resting, it's at right angles. Okay, <laughs> turn it around. Let's see, here's the moment of truth. And we have our scarecrow. Now if you find it's getting a bit stiff like I have, all you have to do is, is you have to loosen your brads a little bit. And that's it. Your little scarecrow is finished. Isn't it adorable? <laughs> I just think it's the cutest thing ever and just perfect for Thanksgiving or um, you know, Harvest Festival for anything like that. So yes, so don't forget to uh, grab your free printable and make your own little scarecrow. In the meantime, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe, but above all, keep watching, keep making. I would love to see you again soon. Take care, bye.